I didn't plan it this way, but the next speaker is from Missouri, Ferguson, Missouri. T Dub, come on up. Yo. <laughs> How y'all doing? Uh, I'm honored to be asked to speak. Um, I don't think y'all understand how important your work is, uh, not just to your community, but to my community. Um, when you look at it and see all the turmoil and pain that we go through in the inner cities and in the urban community and in black communities, a lot of this is centered around strictly the, the drug war. Besides racism and classism, it's around the drug war, the hashtags, the fact that Mike Brown was followed and harassed by Darren Wilson, that's, that's part of the drug war. Um, before standing in front of armored vehicles and MRAPs in Ferguson, I've seen them firsthand my entire life. Uh, the MRAPs and the door rammers coming into communities, breaking in doors and houses. So the, the 1033 and these militarized police have been terrorizing our neighborhoods long before 2014 in August. And that was around the drug war. Um, what I want to do for y'all this evening is I have a new album coming out. It's called The Drop That Spilt The Cup, which is a Mexican proverb similar to what we say here in the U.S., which is the straw that broke the camel's back, basically meaning enough is enough. We no longer will accept the treatment that we've, that's been bestowed on our people. We will no longer accept these murders. We will no longer accept being criminalized. We would no longer accept this pain. And again, I want to thank you all for the work that you do. Again, you don't understand how important it is. Um, it's not just about legalizing marijuana. It's all, also going to help save lives. It's, it's not just about giving people the right uh, to have the ability to do any substances that's going to make their lives better, make their pain better. It's, it's about saving lives, and it's going to save a lot of lives. This is the introduction to my album. We come from the bottom. Project profits, profit and profits, killer. Another black man for the white-faced capitalist dollar. Watch the flash from Impalas. Crack sandwich bags in my pockets. You win last with the goblins. We shoot back blast at the coppers. We say, fuck America, because it's stolen land built by the slaves. Judges selling kids to the prison early in sixth grade. And they wonder why we scream FTP when we get free cased every day and black people make up over 80% of the jail pop in this land of the free. This for little Ayana, Rakia Boyd, and Freddie Gray. Von Der Myers, Mike Brown, so fuck Sally Mae. Them college loan refunds put plenty dope in these alleyways. From Guerrero to Palestine, I am after mine. Lebanon, Mac 11, though I'm strapped like the Decepticon. Black lives don't matter to Iggy and Mac Miller. And Ronald Reagan was the first American crack dealer. <laughs> we got a black president, but the hood badder than ever. Fuck a trap queen, me I'd rather have a Coretta. A Angela or a Sada. Black tux like a Sinatra. Jay-Z not the only hustler that sat and met with Obama. I'm too killer, it's too iller for these cool niggas. The two lift and remove ceilings like renovation, murder with verses. Since Ferguson floors poison, chemical agents on my tongue. The ramifications of being related to Ramsey's and Helen. Tear gas spit it back in the face of the dragon, descendant of Abraham who reigned in ancient Damascus. Paper pistols in power, plotting, planning to pillage. All these rappers is cowards. I'd rather die a giant than insignificant. Wake up in the morning, mind state is so militant. Ready for whatever the world can handle is brilliance, infatuated with thugging. Representing my section, eliminating. Nation of pests perpetrating piss with spew pestilence. No competitors present can fathom rooming with elephants. Born in the gutter, flew out the struggle riding the Pegasus. No other choice but the hustle. Don't give a fuck, so we sell a bit. Here and there trying to thrive. Fuck survival. We prideful. Thank you. 